Ahlan Sahlan, and welcome to Edupedia World Videos. Elementary Arabic with your instructor, Laura Al Albani. In this lesson, we'll learn about the Islamic calendar, a Taqwim al Hijri. Learning Objectives By the conclusion of this lesson, the student should be able to 1. Give some basic information about the Islamic calendar and 2. Say and write the months of the Islamic year. The Islamic, Muslim, or Hijri calendar, also known as a Taqwim al Hijri in the Arabic language, is a lunar calendar. A year consists of 12 months. Each month consists of 29 or 30 days, making a total of 354 or 355 days in a year. Each Islamic month commences on the birth of the new lunar cycle. Since the Islamic calendar is 10 or 11 days shorter than the Gregorian calendar, the Islamic calendar lags behind the Gregorian calendar. Because of this, each Islamic month falls in different parts of the Gregorian calendar each year. This cycle repeats itself every 33 years. The Islamic calendar is used alongside the Gregorian calendar in many Muslim countries to date important events, such as Eid al-Fitr, Eid al-Adha, and the time of the Hajj. Years are counted since the Hijra, that is, the Prophet Muhammad's emigration from Mecca to Medina in 622 AD. On the 16th of July, on the Gregorian calendar, AH1 started. AH means Anno Hijri, the year of the Hijra. Now let's learn the Hijri months. Listen and repeat after me. Muharram, Safar, Rabia al Awwal, Rabia al Thani, Jumada al Ula, Jumada al Ukhra, Rajab, Sha'ban, Ramadan, Shawwal, Dhul Qa'ida, Dhul Hijjah. Listen once more and repeat after me. Muharram, Safar, Rabia al Awwal, Rabia al Thani, Jumada al Ula, Jumada al Ukhra, Rajab, Sha'ban, Ramadan, Shawwal, Dhul Qa'ida, Dhul Hijjah. Now get your notebook and write down each of the months of the Islamic year. We're going to start with Muharram. Muharram is the first month of the Islamic year. The word Muharram means forbidden. Even before Islam, this month was known as a sacred month in which all unlawful acts were forbidden, most notably the shedding of blood. The second month of the Islamic year is Safar. Safar means the whistling of the wind. The third month of the Islamic year is Rabia al-Awwal. Rabia al-Awwal. Rabia al-Awwal means the first month of spring. The fourth month of the Islamic year is Rabia Athani. Rabia Athani. Rabia Athani means the second month of spring. The fifth month of the Islamic year is Jumada al Ula. Jumada al Ula. Jumada means dry. This was the first month of the drought. Jumada al Ula. The sixth month of the Islamic year is Jumada al Ukhra. Jumada al Ukhra. Literally, it means the other dry month. Jumada al Ukhra. The seventh month of the Islamic year is Rajab. Rajab. Rajab means respect. Rajab was another one of the sacred months in which fighting was forbidden. The eighth month of the Islamic year is Sha'ban. Sha'ban. Sha'ban 
is derived from the word shubba, which means branch. The Arabs used to branch out during this month and look for water. Sha'ban. Ramadan. Ramadan is the ninth month of the Islamic calendar. Ramadan means the month of the heat. Ramadan is the most venerated month of the Hijri calendar. During this time, Muslims must fast from pre-dawn until sunset, and they should give charity to the poor and the needy. The tenth month of the Islamic calendar is Shawwal. Shawwal. Shawwal means raised. It's taken from the word shala, which means when the female camel gets pregnant. The eleventh month of the Islamic calendar is Dhul Qa'ada. Dhul Qa'ada, taken from the word Qa'ada, which means to sit. During this month, people would stop their businesses and prepare for the Hajj. The twelfth and final month of the Islamic calendar is Dhul Hijjah. Dhul Hijjah. Dhul Hijjah is the month of the Hajj. Let's practice the names of the months a few more times. I'm going to say it and I want you to repeat it after me. Muharram. Safar. Rabia al Awwal. Rabia al Thani. Jumada al Ula. Jumada al Ukhra. Rajab. Sha'ban. Ramadan, Shawwal, Dhul Qa'ida, Dhul Hijjah. And this brings us to the end of our lesson. By now, you should be able to say and write the 12 months of the Islamic calendar. If you're not able to do it yet, make sure to keep practicing. Ma Salamah.